Good morning, YouTube. Uh, happy Wednesday. Today is September the September the sixth, and I am on my way to the airport. Uh, excuse me, my voice is not like there yet. Um, but I'm on my way to the airport. I'm about to get my drink on because it's officially my vacation today and i just got some trader joe's finishing off this trader joe's mango uh wine seca mango so i gotta call my lyft driver because i don't support uber and yeah just get ready to head to the airport my flight is at six i am early for once usually i have a problem with catching 6 a.m flights but i guess since i've been doing it for quite some time now I know how to prepare my body and um yeah basically get up for this flight so let me go ahead and pull my drink and i'll see y'all in belize bye put this stuff down I'll tell you what oh. you know how I'm supposed to be leaving to go to Belize today looks like that won't happen <laughs> because I missed my flight out and I broke a nail I missed my flight and sitting at the wrong gate so um tip to uh, everybody out there don't trust Google for your gate information you know I learned the hard way I was sitting at the gate I guess that they posted um, yesterday um, and so Southwest put on their tickets that the gate are subjects to change prior to departure so I'm just sitting at the gate at the gate mind you this is a 6 a.m. flight I'm sitting at the gate sitting at the gate I don't see nobody lining up, you know, nothing. I was like, okay, are we going to leave anytime soon? Until one of the other flight attendants at the gate that I was at initially came over and was just like, what flight um, are you on? And I'm just telling her um, I was going from Chicago to Fort Lauderdale, from Fort Lauderdale to Belize. Me. And um, she was just like, Oh no, you're at the wrong gate. Uh, you're supposed to be at gate A48, and I was at gate B2. And gate A48 is like all the way on the other side of uh, the airport, um, and it's not an easy air uh, easy gate to find. So um, I'm running, I'm running, I'm running. I'm trying to find gate A48. I passed it and went straight to gate A19 because the other gates like gate 4A and all that bull crap break off at a certain point and I got a little confused so I'm asking the flight attendant I hear them like uh keep saying if you're looking for the the flight to Fort Lauderdale it's gate A48 so I'm running, 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 and I finally make that turn and go in the right direction of gate A48. And then that's when the person was just like, uh, Kamaya Wentworth, this is your last time. Uh, final notice for you to board the gate. You need to board it immediately. So I'm running. I'm, I'm running book bag and my carry on it. Oh, I'm trucking it. I'm trying to make it. So I finally get there. I see a lady. Um, she has a walkie talkie and she's like, you're too late. And I lost it. Like, I broke out crying. <laughs> I was crying thinking about it now. Like, have, it, it's like so stupid. Like, I was literally sitting at the wrong gate thanks to Google. Really? Google? Google's supposed to be like, like, I started crying already. She was just like, um... You was at the wrong gate, and I was just, 
this is so stupid. And because it's something that you can't control. And so I'm just like, what do you mean? I was at the game. I'm cursing. Like, <laughs> this is so stupid. Cursing and everything. It's still fresh. That's why I'm probably still crying. So I'm cursing. I was like, are you kidding? Are you serious? I was sitting at the gate. And she was just like, yeah, but the gates are subject to change. And I was just like, and she's like, and it even says on your ticket, the, um, <laughs> it had it on a stupid ticket. What gate I was at, but I'm trusting handy dandy fucking Google. And, uh, I was just like, I, I lost it. I, I was just like, not having it. And I was like, cancel my ticket. Are you going to refund me my lift? And like, I was just not a happy camper. I'm still not a happy camper, but she did help me book another flight for tomorrow. So hopefully I'll be able to um, get on that flight. It's just a lot waking up at 2.30 in the morning, you know, and I usually don't wake up that early to try to make a flight. Like I was going to be on time. You saw me, I'm like, I don't usually wake up this early, which is true. Or I usually don't make my early flights. Like, I'm usually making my early flights by the skin of my nose because I'm, like, literally bad at waking up at, like, 2.30. Who wakes up at that time? If I'm not at, out and about at a party or at a club or whatever, I'm not up at 2.30. I'm not out. So, yeah. <laughs> I'm, I'm just like, I feel so stupid. So, my flight, uh, the flight that they booked me on is uh, for tomorrow, same time, which I'm not a fan of. But, you know what? You just got to roll with the punches, you know? When life give you lemons, make lemonade. So, maybe I can take this day to, like, go get my eyebrows done because that's what I really wanted to do yesterday. But uh, I had to work and... I work from home and then the place that I like to get my eyebrows uh, done at is nowhere near my house. It's like closer to my job. <clears throat> but yeah, at least my baggage will make it to Belize today. But I won't make it to Belize. It's just a whole day off like wasted, I feel, to me. But maybe this is a way, you know, that God's just like, slow down you know you don't always have to be on the go 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 rush 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 because that's usually my schedule i'm always moving i never really have that that much downtime to myself uh so maybe this is his way of like take a break you know go back to sleep get some rest before you know this trip because i'm pretty sure we're gonna be moving all while i'm down there so yeah i just had to tell you guys that story and Hopefully tomorrow will be a better day. Maybe I'll sit down and edit some vlogs or whatever, but I'll just use this time to, you know, just relax a little bit because traveling takes a lot out of me. I know when I travel, I'm exhausted. I, I just, and then like to do, have something like this stupid happen, I'm just like, really, really? But it happens, just roll with it. And Yes, uh, we'll try this again tomorrow. My lovely sister came over to see me. Why do you do that? When people don't want, it's not even ready. I look like a bum. This is real life. <clears throat> yeah, my lovely sister. Sorry if I got food in my mom. Um, she came over to see me. Um, been trying to get up with her all weekend, but she's booked and busy. No, that's you. <laughs> that was you. Booked and busy. Um, I gotta come here. I'm already at Costco. I'm going to the barbecue. <laughs> so, maybe this was a way for us to spend time together. That's why I missed my flight. Huh? You missed your flight because you slow. Hey. I'm not sure coach. Google sent me off. Nope. You sent you off. Let me, let me just show y'all something. Ouch, I just hit my foot. That's the new ticket. Don't let. Alright, so she wouldn't be. Talking about Google, but she got this. They, they give it to you, even if you get a digital one. Mm. In your phone, they still give it to you. Hey. Gate. B8. <laughs> Thank you. Your
your shit, your shit is under here, your damn passport. I got it. Thank you for dinner. You're welcome. It was delicious. Wake up. She got me Nando's. Um, I spent today, you know, editing vlogs. And um, I went to go get my eyebrows done. So. Did you like it? Yeah. I did. I told you. I've been telling you to go there forever. I know. You've been going so far. Because it's, it's close to work. It's close to work. But still, you live over here now. I know. And now you have options. I know. I'm in like a, a what? Uh, what do you call this? Is it a popular area? I guess so. But we had so many shops and stuff. Like local, local owned shops and stuff. They're just now getting like a Target. They got a Chipotle, Pop Bellies, and stuff like that. But uh, mainly, it's local shops, and there's so many of them. So it's just like I never really think twice to go and try out local shops. Even though the place that I go to by work is a local shop, too. But it's far. So, well, it's not that far, but it's far enough. So, thank you for dinner. Appreciate it. Ow, your freaking hair. Oh. Scratch my eyes. I gotta take this garbage out because I don't wanna leave any garbage. Yeah, right. Um you ain't doing that five in the morning. No, I'm doing now because I that because it's gonna be I, we, and Peppy Le Pew may be out. Could you please stop? No, I'm so serious. And that's another reason why I was crying because I was just like, I don't wanna see Peppy Le Pew because I saw a skunk this morning and I was just like, I don't wanna bad, bad. You can go out this door, you'll be quicker this way. Digging a new place. Yeah. My roommate is not my roommate anymore. Well, I know you're tired and I know you got work. So, yeah, let's go. My roommate's not my roommate. You're not my roommate. This was my roommate. She can't live with roommates. Then she abandoned me. I did not abandon you. I'm poor. Oh my God. If you have money saved, my, I don't want to hear it. Okay, I'm <laughs> you, it's it's a safety, so you gotta twist and pull. What the hell? Yes. Well, let me walk her out. No, just it, and twist after and that. Just pull this. Oh, really? Let me see. Just pull. No. Nope. It did work for me. It worked. Because the door is open. Because you, I twisted and you opened the door. Oh. It's a safety. I think a safety regulation. That's but yeah, let me walk her out. And take this garbage out, and you guys will see me at 3 o'clock in the morning, 3.30.